Those of you who paid attention in chemistry class know that aluminium and copper are both metals. Those of you who might not pay that good attention at chemistry class might now think that it should be easy to melt them together into one piece. Unfortunately, it's not that easy. I'm Mike Poulter, I'm a product manager at Trumpf and I'm a pro in pulse fiber lasers. And my secret power is I can navigate exclusively by the location of bars and coffee houses. Hi Mike, good hey. to see you. You too. I have heard that you have the perfect solution for welding thin metals, right? That's right, absolutely. With True Pulse Nano, we have a novel laser-based method for welding thin section dissimilar metals. That is, we can weld and join any combination of different metals together. Usually less than one to two millimeters in section. There is no combination we can't do. Okay, Mike, that sounds awesome. And of course, I want to test how effortlessly the True Pulse Nano works. So I have two thin pieces of metal here. One is made of aluminium, one is made of copper, and I want you to weld them together. Of course, I need a strong weld and I need a clean work, means no scratches at all on the metal. Do you accept the challenge? Challenge accepted. Okay, cool. Then let's hit the button. Okay, wow, well, that's awesome. It looks very even and strong, and the best thing is no damage to the metals at all. No scratches. I mean, crazy. How does that work technically? So with True Pulse Nano, we have the controlled delivery of nanosecond pulses. This limits the duration of the melt pool and the time of the melting period. This means that we don't have long-term melt that can form intermetallic alloys. These intermetallic alloys, which happen with conventional welding, can form brittle intermetallic compounds that can have very different properties to the two materials that are being joined together. This means that the weld can be weak and it can also have things like lower electrical conductivity. With this process, we have a very limited melt time. It means that the two metals do not actually metallurgically interact. It's more of a mechanical bond than a me metallurgical one. Mike, the whole demonstration was like really impressive. What else is the laser capable of? So True Pulse Nano is extremely versatile. The same beam source could be not only used for joining, but also welding, cutting, marking, and even cleaning. You can see some examples here of most metallic materials. In fact, some non-metallic materials also. So taking a quick sneak peek into the future, where is the trend going with this laser, technically speaking? So the intrinsic versatility of True Pulse Nano is always opening up new material applications and processes. As we go and move to higher average powers, we're also enabling higher productivity and speeds with these processes. Well, it seems like Mike did pay attention in chemistry class and put all his knowledge about metals into his job. Good for us and good for those of you who still need some help in terms of welding. Oh, by the way, if you have a problem that seems to be impossible to be solved, feel free to contact us and challenge our pros. <laughs>